Hello folks, welcome to Sherwood Park Toyota, located at 31 Automall Road in Sherwood Park, Alberta, Canada. Today I'm going to be showing you this new Toyota Tundra TRD Off-Road. Now the most notable features on this TRD Off-Road is its seated front seats, its parking sensors, as well as its backup camera. Now I'm going to go through a couple more features on the inside and outside of the vehicle, just to get you better familiar with this new Toyota Tundra TRD Off-Road. Let's get started. Now a couple of the exterior features that you will see on this TRD Off-Road is it's daytime running lights, you also have your fog lamps, and then if we take a look at your front bumper, you're going to see your plug-in block heater, along with your parking sensors, and then over on the side you have your 18-inch aluminum alloy wheels. Now you also have the foldable mirrors, as well as the heated mirrors, vortex generators, and one of the nice things with the vortex generators, they actually assist with aerodynamics of the vehicle, as well as help with fuel efficiency, and you can find them on your tail lamps. And the color we're going to be taking a look at today is cement. Now to start off with, we're going to be taking a look at your front dash as well as your front seats, just so you have a much better idea of how much space there is. Now you have your black cloth interior seat surfaces with your power driver seat with lumbar support. Taking a look just over on your left hand side. You have your mirror controls along with your automatic headlights and then you have your open and close for your power rear window. On the inside of your driver's side door you have your window locks, power locks, window controls for both your front and rear windows. Now a couple of the controls you'll see here on the steering wheel include your scroll function, volume control, mode select, as well as your voice recognition, your Bluetooth, and scroll function for your multi-informational display, along with your lane departure alert and cruise control. Now one of the nice things with this display is that you have a couple of different options on here, including your exterior temperature gauge, digital speedometer, as well as range, and then if you scroll through it, you can see a couple of other additional features, including your navigation, audio, lane departure alert, messages, and then your settings for your lane departure alert, pre-collision system, and then a couple of other additional features. Now over on your right hand side you're going to see your parking sensors on and off, traction control on and off, tow haul, and then you have your trailer brake. Now taking a look at your center dash as well as your touch panel display, you're going to see a couple of different options on here, heading into the apps menu. You have your navigation audio phone as well as a couple of other additional features. You also have your digital clock and then heading down below, you also have the uh, satellite radio, 4x4 selector, hazard lights, temperature control settings with your fan speed, temperature control and mode select. Underneath you'll see your two power outlets at both ends as well as your heated seat controls for your driver and passenger. USB and auxiliary, matted to a automatic transmission. At the very top you have your auto dimming rear view mirror with integrated garage door opener and digital compass and at the very top you'll find your open and close and tilt up and down feature for your power moonroof with your sunglass case holder for those days when it's quite bright outside. Finally we'll be taking a look at your rear cargo area as well as your tailgate now located on your rear bumper you're going to see your parking sensors just look at it right across and one of the nice things with the rear bumper is it's a three piece bumper so in the event that you damage the one section you just have to replace the one segment. You have your 7 and your 4 pin for your towing located just underneath, you'll find your spare tire. And then on the back of the tailgate you have your backup camera on your left, lock on your right hand side. And the other thing I like is that you have a nice easy lowering tailgate, so instead of it coming down really fast it comes down very gently. The other nice thing with the TRD off-road is it does come with a bed rail system, so the nice thing with that bed rail system is that you have those readjustable cleats that you see on either side there that you can place at the very front of the bed rail system or all on one side or take them out all together just in case you're hauling something that's in the way of them. Now over on your left, right, front and back side you're going to see a couple of areas where you can tie down any loose cargo just so it's not shifting around just while you're driving. Thank you so much folks for watching this video today. If you have any questions please visit us. We're located at 31 Automall Road in Sherwood Park, Alberta, Canada. The phone number is 780-410-2455 or please visit our website at sptoyota.com to get us by email. Once again folks, thank you so much for watching this video today. If you have any comments or any additional questions, please leave them in the comment section located down below. Other than that, make sure you have a great day and I hope to see you next time.